assalamu alaikum in this video we will discuss role of renin angiotensin aldosterone system as well as atrial natriuretic peptide in maintenance of blood pressure in the beginning when there is hypertension it stimulates the production of atrial natriuretic peptide from the heart and this atrial natriuretic peptide is when released it performs two functions first one is it leads to vasodilation by acting on the blood vessels and therefore decreases the blood pressure the next thing is it excretes the sodium and water from the kidneys and therefore and therefore volume of the blood is decreased and blood pressure is decreased to the normal levels blood pressure is decreased to the normal levels now if hypertension occurs then it can occur due to either low volume or low resistance by the arterioles then it due to low renal blood pressure and low levels of sodium causes the production of renin from the kidneys from the kidneys renin is released renin can be released either due to increased sympathetic activity or due to low sodium levels in the kidneys now what happens this renin is when released then this renin acts on the angiotensinogen that is produced from the liver and angiotensin 1 is produced this angiotensin 1 is converted into angiotensin 2 by the action of angiotensin converting enzyme that is mostly present in the uh, uh, lungs but it can be present in many other tissues but mainly present in the lungs what happens now this angiotensin 2 acts on the blood vessels and causes vasoconstriction as well as it can act on the adrenal glands and causes the release of aldosterone aldosterone levels are when increased then it leads to the reabsorption of sodium and water from the kidneys and therefore fluid volume in the body is increased due to which plasma volume is increased and blood pressure is increased to the normal levels and when again hypertension occurs the cycle continues so this is the role of the renin angiotensin aldosterone system and atrial natriuretic peptide in the maintenance of this normal tension that is the balance between hypotension and hypertension this is the normal tension that is maintained by this system thank you for watching please make sure to subscribe to this channel